So you finished your worksheet um, and you answered every question as best as you could in complete sentences. So what we're going to do now is um, we're going to move forward. So what I would like you to do is first of all make your heading as usual. You can remember you can change um, this is called your cursor, this blinking light. It's where your text starts, right? So if I would like, if a teacher wants your header over here, you can click the paragraph um, center. You can align your text to the right. So that's what we're going to do. And so you can type in your name, your, num your student number, whatever you want, tech four, the date, okay? Um, okay. And then in the middle, I'd like you to give your, I'd like you to give your reflection an interesting title. It's up to you, okay? You come up with something and um, be creative with it. So I'm, I'll just write creative, interesting title here. Anyway, okay, so keeping aligned in the center, what I want you to do is you're going to insert the bar chart you made. So what we need to do is we need to go back to our Excel uh, Excel sheet and you're gonna click on the very edge or actually I guess you could click anywhere on it but click near the edge of this box with your chart in it so that your cursor has this um, the, the arrow with the four arrows going in different directions. Click on it and you should see it selected. You're gonna you can either do this two ways. You can right click and hit copy. And then when we, so we could do it like this. Right? Or you can um, click Control C once you have this selected. Right? Control C. And then once we get to our Microsoft Word, Control V. And there you go. You just pasted your chart right in there. So. When you can click or hit enter on your keyboard that's going to take you to the next line and then I'd like you to align your text back to the left and you can cl uh, hit the tab button to give yourself an indent and from here on out I would just like you to type out only the answers to the questions you answered on your worksheet only the answers they should be in complete sentences so I'm just going to write that there for now when you're finished, you're going to go to save it somewhere, and guess where you're going to save it? If you're thinking the sandbox, you're completely right, so you're going to go to the sandbox, Ms. Tapia, Tech 4, and there is a folder called Green Ninja, uh, I'm sorry, Green Ninja Reflections, and you're going to save it there with your name as the file name, and you hit save, and you're done.